as part of its consumer protection drive, an area for long left with glaring challenges. The Ghana National Bureau of Standards is now targeting imports to read the market of substandard goods. 232 metric tons of substandard goods worth 1.7 billion were seized from the market. And again, as someone asked, what are these goods? Now we are finding that increasingly these are largely imported products. And the number one imports are electrical and electronics products. Over time, goods seized under the PIVOC program, 4.6 billion products inspected, 4.2 billion products passed, 16 million substandard products failed, and 246 second-hand motor vehicles denied entry into the country. Ben Manindo, the executive director, Uganda National Bureau of Standards, also says traders are increasingly making losses in relation to seizures of non-compliant goods. To appeal to the business community to cut down on uh, uh, cost of doing business, especially for those who are importing, without coming with a certificate of compliance. Because when they come without a certificate of compliance, they take almost one month in the ICD in the customs area. And uh, we also surcharge them 15%. So in the end, the cost of their, of their business increases, which is not desirable. The report released today also indicates that in the period between July and December 2017, 48 metric tons of substandard goods worth about 950 million shillings were destroyed. The goods that were seized, I've said part of it has already been destroyed. Uh, I think it was about 145 uh, metric tons have been destroyed. But the others have got issues. Some of them are undergoing a court process and others are under further dis uh, investigation as far as our laboratory uh, testing is concerned. When those are disposed, then we shall make uh, a decision on whether to destroy them or otherwise.